Yo, what's good? It's your boy T-R-E-N-T, -E and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new EP reaction by your boy Gus Dapperton. I'm a new fan of Gus Dapperton. I've been on him ever since I've heard him on Crew Santino, which is my favorite artist. He's the intro and the outro on my records, but he introduced me to Gus Dapperton, and I reacted to his last album and his last couple of projects and singles. But anywho, he got a new EP called Tune for Late Spring, and unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the songs. I do not pause the songs. I listen to the whole song, and at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from zero to ten, ten being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know, that's five and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a six. Now, if it's a good song, depending on how good y'all think it is, that's seven to ten. So make sure y'all stay tuned to the end so y'all can give y'all grade with me. And when we get the 10K subs, there will be a Cash App giveaway after every reaction. You could be a winner. So make sure y'all subscribe to all my social media. Look, Trent Music is spelled the same way as my channel. So without further ado, this is Gus Dapperton. Tunes for late fucking spring. Fucking going on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. Let tune. I'm watching the video of him reacting to the music, so stay to the end.
All right, that's Latoon featuring Electric Guest. I believe that's their name. Um, first of all, before I give my grade, I want to say that's how you write a song. It has substance. It have a beginning. It have an end. It had two verses. It had a bridge. It had, you know what I'm saying, a climax. That's how you write a song. And um, like I said, Gus Dapperton, I found out about him through Cruz Santino, which a lot of people not own. And I don't want to gatekeep. That's why I like doing the uh, reaction so y'all could get put on. But um, I like being not only just the first reactor, I like being the first person that's on their music. You know what I'm saying? Um, Tizo Touchdown is another one of them artists that I, I discovered, you know what I'm saying, with the reactions. And he got a big fan base. Of course, he popped up on Drake Records and Big Records. I think Gus Dapperton worked with a lot of big artists, but he's still on the rise. And he's a um, white boy. I don't know where he's from, but he got a soulful voice. He His pen game is dope. For as far as I know, like it sounds like he write his own records because it's consistent. It's a story. It's it's about love. It's and it's and it got a little slang. I'm fucked up on you. You know what I'm saying? It's, it it gets you in your feelings. So um, zero out of ten though. Like I always say, there's a ten is a perfect song. Nine is something I'm gonna add to my playlist. But this song, I'm gonna give zero out of ten. I'm gonna give it eight. Um, it could go higher just depending on how good this ep is it's only a four track um ep so we gonna y'all don't gotta worry about me skipping we're gonna go to the next song make sure y'all leave y'all great make sure y'all subscribe like i said it may be a winner one of y'all you dig so um if y'all rocking out click that next video if not i hope